Hey, what's up everyone? This is OK Chief. And um, I wanted to show you guys really quick, if you didn't know this little trick uh, right now, I just wanted to give you guys a really quick heads up on how to take a marker off of labels without damaging the labels. Now, I can't take credit for this. I'm at work right now and I'm in front of my computer and uh, all all credit goes to Andre Lejean Cook Jr. And uh, here's a quick video on how he did it. And it's basically the same way I'm going to show you. It's super easy. God damn, thank you so much, Andre. You rock. He even, because he posted on there um, about a little mark that was on a uh, this game that I'm selling. I'm actually selling this game. And uh, he saw on my post, well, he noticed that uh, it had that marker on there. And um, I really didn't pay attention to that at all. And he noticed it right away. He goes, hey, brother, I got a way for you to take that. I see I already started it. And uh, he, ha he managed to find a way to do it. And all you really need is a dry eraser marker. That's it. All you need is this. You know how cheap these are? That's insane, guys. Now, basically, I'm going to show you what he shows me there in that picture. So what you do is you try, I guess you get the same color as the marker. So if the marker on your cart is black, get a black one. If your marker is red, I guess you can try it on both, but I just tried it with this red. So basically what you want to do is go ahead i know this is crazy you're marking it up more trust me i know it trust me but uh, check that out it's like breaking apart the particles or something look at that it's just coming right off and just wipe it off look at that and it's not even damaging the cart at all look at this oh my god that's insane so just lightly you just want to lightly keep going over it. Freaking insane, guys. Oh, my God. This is the best. I was like, what kind of witchcraft are you doing, Andre? I got all scared. I'm like, this is insane. I'm sure some other people figured this out, but I didn't know about it. And thanks to Andre, thanks to Andre, this is... Uh, pretty cool here oh man it's like a little bit gotta be more lighter on this gonna go a little lighter and just rub it away just rub it away see how that comes off see how that comes off see I was doing a little hard there but if you go lightly well now I'm gonna start doing it lightly if you go lightly it'll start coming away slowly but surely it fades away it fades away guys so there you have it guys he took out that f right there holy shit that's me by pushing down too hard i pushed down here i felt i i did i feel pressure on that he did say to go very lightly and uh, i pressed down on that right there so that's my fault that right there is my fault but the rest if you go really lightly uh i'm sure it'll all come off now i'm gonna keep continuing and i'll show you here in a second um through the power of editing I'll show you guys really quick how the completed product. So give me a second. Okay, guys, I'm back and I'm done with this cool little uh, quick quick tip on how to get uh, markers off your cartridges. So basically, you want to practice first because you don't want to mess up a, a good cart like this. Or any other good cart you might have that's kind of messed up with marker. So get a, a a sports title one or something stupid that you don't care about, and practice on that before you practice on one of these. I suggest getting a really light, like tissue paper, rather than like a hard, because that's 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 my fault. All that that's not the technique's fault. That's my fault because I didn't use the proper wiping technique i should have you you can use your finger as well but uh the 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 one i used at first was this stupid namkin which rubbed away uh, a little bit on the paint there but that's okay that stuff just came right off with 
this cool technique. Like I said, if I think you should post to use the same uh, marker color as the marker that it's on. So if it's black, use black. If it's red, use red. I think uh, that's how I kept that safe. But uh, the like I said before, all credit goes to Andre and uh, his. I asked what his channel name was for his YouTube channel because he does tips and tricks like that on his channel. And uh, his name is Retro Zapper on YouTube, and he does quick little cool tips like this. He and uh, I suggest you guys for more tips, you go over there to his channel and subscribe, and uh, he'll show you tricks like this to get stuff off your cartridges. That, like I said, that's my fault for not knowing the technique. That's I should have practiced before, but I was really excited to see this stuff come right off, man. The technique works. It's just how you use the technique, because um, that I I pressed I, I used a lot of pressure as I was wiping away. I was wiping it off too hard with the different type of wiping uh, material. It's you just need I guess you either either use your finger or something that you don't scratch it off with too hard and uh, it'll come out perfectly fine. As you seen earlier, that shit said Fay or something. Now you can't even see it at all. So that's awesome, man. The really cool thanks to Andre for that awesome little tip. Don't forget to check out his channel. And uh, yeah, all credit goes to him, man. Thank you so much for showing me that. I really appreciated that. Just all you needed was this cheap $1 dry eraser marker. Thanks a lot, buddy. I really appreciate it. And everyone else, go check out his channel. Peace out, y'all.